Hey, it's Llama Lulu, and welcome back to my channel. Hey, my llamas. Welcome back to my channel. And I finally got Pokemon Shield. Whoop, whoop. Um, I'm such an awkward person on the mic, I swear. So let's start it. Um... Fortunately, I have to use my mic that I use on the PC, and this is, like, so uncomfortable, you guys. Like, you have no idea. English. Choose your photo from the lineup. What is this? Choose your photo from the lineup. Wait, why the guy's red but the girl's green? Okay, um... Let's just do... Llama Lulu, you can't change languages after starting your game. Confirm that your information is correct. Correct. Registration complete. Now saving. Your progress in this game will automatically be saved with the autosave function. That's convenient. Oh, wow. Welcome one and all. Welcome to the wonderful world of Pokemon. Our beloved Galar region is a wonderful place with thriving nature. Oh, look at the map in the background. Beautiful cities and many Pokemon with which we share our lives. As you know, our society is able to thrive. Okay. Oh, okay. Thanks to the help from these mysterious creatures that we call Pokemon. Of course, of course. Yes, Pokemon all, all around us, excuse me. In the sea, in the sky, and even with us in our towns. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we know that. And those of us who choose to raise and train Pokemon to do battle and compete we call Pokemon Trainers. Okay, but getting carried away, please allow me to introduce myself. Yes, please do. My name is Rose, and it is a pleasure to be here. Rose. Rose? It's like a lady name. Now turn your gaze to the Galar region's greatest Pokemon trader, your undefeated champion. It's time for Champion Leon's Exhibition Match. Okay, are we gonna watch a match now? Oh wow. Okay, Charizard. Exhibition or not? Wow, I am so tired. Charizard Dynamax. Okay. Are they trying to show us the Dynamax creature? Wow. Wow. My controller was even shaking. Okay, so was that like the intro? That's cute, I guess. Oh, look at the cute little shapes. Adorable. So, is that baby Snorly? So cute. Is that supposed to be me? Okay. Hello, hello, Hop. Is that her friend? Well, our friend, I guess, as we should say. 
Oh, that your flash new phone, Lama Lulu? Guessing this is our friend. <clears throat> Were you watching Lee's exhibition match on it? But you can't cheer him on with your hands full. You know the only way to properly cheer on Lee would be with his famous Charizard pose. Is that my mom? Mum. Hop, didn't expect to see you here today, dear. Isn't this the big day? Yeah, that's exactly why I came running over to get Llama Lulu. Never mind, watching the match now. I've got it recording at home anyway. I record all my brother's matches. <gasps> that's his brother! Oh, wow! Interesting. Come with me, Llama Lulu. He should be here any minute. And Lee always brings presents when he visits, so I wouldn't forget that bag if I were you. Now I've got to run. See you at mine later. What? That's so crazy. Okay. Oh, hey. Am I supposed to move? Give me one second. This is so annoying. You guys have no idea. Um. Okay, wow. Oh, he's so cute. <laughs> oh, he's smiling. He is so adorable. Okay, so we can't really like move the camera around, I'm guessing. If you're looking for your bag, Lama Lolo, didn't you leave it in your room? And grab yourself a hat for the weather as well. But where's our room? Hmm. So that's my mom. Oh, so our room is wide open. Okay. You grabbed your mom's old bag. Okay, strange. Adventure guide. Open the X menu by pressing the X button. Okay. You can save your progress by selecting save from the X menu. You can also check your location and your next destination by selecting the town map. And you can check this adventure guide anytime you want in the key item section of your bag. Okay. Hop is waiting for you. Better head outside. Okay, okay, this is cute. The home is cute. I like it. Very, very detailed. I love that. And look, another one. A... Wow. It says... But... I don't even know. But do you do? do you do? I'm guessing. If I'm wrong, let me know. Ha ha ha, have a look at you. Oh, that old bag looks like I could pull you over. At least we know that it should hold anything we might bring, even if it's a big as a Snorlax. axe. A Wooloo? But what's it doing here? Hey you silly Wooloo, I see that you're up to what you're up to. Don't go using tackle on the fencing. Now you listen. Now no going past that fence. No. Everyone knows there are scary Pokemon living in the slumbering wield. <laughs> How about it, Lamalulu? Let's race, but I can make it to my house first. What? With you, bet I can make it to my house. Oh my god, I just said that. What with you lugging about that big old bag? I think I really stink at reading you guys. Sorry.
Well, where's this house? Is this his house? I just walked into like somebody's house. Okay, it is his house. Okay, and I'm guessing that's his mom. Mom, is he here? There you are, last hop. Oh, and you've brought along Lemma Lulu. Hello, dear. Yeah, yeah, but where's Lee? Have you got him crammed in a cupboard? He's still not here yet for the hundredth time. Honestly, Hop, you must learn some patience. <laughs> He's probably only just arrived at the station in Widgehurst. Then that's where I'm going. You know, Lee is hopeless with directions. I'll, I'll make sure he doesn't get lost in on the way. Oh, will you? Yes, that probably is for the best. You've got to come with me, Lala Lulu. You've still never met my big bro, right? You can't miss out on your chance to meet the undefeated champion. I'll wait for you on, out on the roof. Okay, where's the exit? This way? Okay, so the intro is like... Very cute. Where they live is very cute too, I like it. Let's get a move on. Only remember Lama Lulu. Wild Pokemon could come out of nowhere if you walk through patches of tall grass. I've got my Lulu with me, so I'm ready for battles against wild Pokemon, of course. But not you, Lama Lulu, so we'll steer clear of the tall grass as we go. Okay. Thanks, bud. Route 1. Let's go and meet Lee at the station. It's dead ahead from here. There's a huge crowd, I can see, of course. He's already there. Hello, Wedgehurst. Your champion, Leon, is back. I promise I'll keep doing my best to deliver the greatest battles for you to all, watch, all to watch. It's your unbeatable champion, Leon. You and Charizard are the greatest. Well, thank you for that. I hope you all carry on training up your Pokemon and never shy from battle. Then come challenge me for the champion title. We're on it. We'll... We've all been working on our battle skills, just like you've taught us to, Lee. But that Charizard of yours is too strong for the likes of us to take on. Too true, that Charizard is blazingly strong, but other Pokemon can be strong as well. That's why I want the strongest of challengers to fill the gym challenge and come battle me. My wish is for us to work together to become the strongest in all the world. Rar. Lee. Hop. So my number one fan in all the world has come out of his way to pick me up. Look at you, Hop. I reckon you've grown exactly an inch and a quarter since the last time I saw you. Bingo! That's the sort of sharp eye that keeps you undefeated so long, eh, lady? In these bright eyes over here, I've got it. You must be Lama Lulu, am I right? <laughs> Indeed. I've heard loads about you from my little brother. I'm the Galar region's greatest ever Pokemon champion and a massive Charizard fan, too. People call me the unbeatable Leon. Come on, Lee. You and Lama Lulu, but... I can beat the both of you back home. That hop, always wanting to be the best, isn't he? With a proper rival of his own, I bet he'd push himself to become something truly special. Well everyone, I bid you farewell for today, but don't you fret. I'll always be around to make sure everyone in the Galar ha can have a champion time. Okay.
Interesting. Okay. Come on, Lee. You promised us a present, so out with it. You brought Lama Lulu and me Pokemon. You did, didn't you? I know you must have. Right then, the greatest gift from the greatest champion. It's showtime, everyone. I'm confused. So he's giving us Pokemons? The professor? Take a good look, you two. The grass type Pokemon Grookey. The fire type Pokemon Scorbunny. And water type Pokemon Sobble. All right, line up, everyone. Which one? Which will you choose? So I get to choose first. I'm guessing. Wow, this is so different. Um, go on, you pick first. I've already got my Lulu after all. I really want Score Bunny. I just love Fire Type. Score Bunny is a Fire Type. It's filled with it's filled to bursting with fiery passion. You're set on the Fire Type Pokemon Score Bunny. Yes, I love Fire Type. I love Fire Type and um, Electricity Type, like. I am obsessed with Pikachu. Like, if I could, I would buy everything, everything that has to do with Pikachu. I, like, legit mean it. You choose Scorbunny. Would you like to give Scorbunny a nickname? Uh, let's name him Bun Bun. Ha. I just think it's cute. Bun Bun. Bun Bun has been added to your party! Yay! Oh, that's so cute! Normally they like catch it with like the Pokeball and stuff. Wow, this is really so different. So, it'll be Score Bunny for you. Nice one. Then I'll go with Brokey. You're mine. I'm aiming to be the next champion, so be ready. You and I'll be doing some serious training. Oh, he's so cute too. I bet you will be, Hop. That's why I brought along these Pokemon for you and Lama Lulu. So the two of you can battle and train and grow stronger together to try to reach me. And you'll come with me. Charizard will show you the ropes. He's strict, but real strong and real kind too. <laughs> All right, enough of all this trainer nonsense for one night. Dinner's ready, children. Bring along your Pokemon and let's all eat. Well, that's so cute. So, like, their moms get along together, too. This is so, like, different from, like, the original Pokemons that we played with. Love it. I love it how they changed it up. I'm guessing we're at the house now. The next day, you spent the whole night with that new partner of yours, right, Hop? You two getting on all right, understanding one another? Maybe even built up a little bit of love? Of course I have, Lee. Mama Lulu's made fast friends with her score bunny, too. Then listen up, new trainers. Believe in yourself and your Pokemon. If you trust in one another and carry on battling side by side long enough, then someday, you might even become worthy rivals for me, the unbeatable champion. What are you looking at her for, Lee? I'm the one who'll be coming to challenge you. 
If you think Lama Lulu might be able to challenge you, then I guess she's my first rival. But I'm not planning to lose her and miss out on my chance to be the unbe unbeatable champion. Just having a Pokemon with you doesn't make you a real trainer, you know. Proper trainers raise their Pokemon up to be the first rate in battle, too. Oh, and you think you're worthy of calling yourself such a proper trainer already, Hop? Guess I'll be the judge of that. Let's see how you handle yourself in a battle against your friend, if she's up for it. What do you say? Willing to, ready to take Hop in on the first ba Pokemon battle of your life? Yes. Believe in your partner Pokemon and care for them too with all of your heart. So do those two things and I'm certain you'll learn to choose the moves that suit your Pokemon. And more importantly, to have a champion time battling with them. Looks like everyone's on board. Pokemon and trainers alike, then let's do this. I've watched every match Lee's ever done. I've read every book and magazine he left behind at home too. I know exactly what to do in order to win. Okay. Our first battle is with our friend. Okay, you are challenged, challenged by Pokemon Trainer Hop. Pokemon Trainer Hop sent out Wooly. Okay, and then I only have Scorbun. Go, Bun Bun! Pokemon battle it is then. I've got two partners with me. He does, that's true. Um. What is, um, we'll start with tackle first. Bun Bun use tackle. Okay. The opposing Lulu use tackle. Okay. Let's do growl. I don't know what this does, but let's find out. Bun Bun use growl. What does that do? The opposing Lulu's. Okay. Um, I couldn't read that. It was too fast. Or oh, I think I clicked the button too fast. I don't know. Bun Bun use tackle. Oh, wow. Okay. Bun Bun use tackle, and Wulu is out. But now he has um, XP points. Bun Bun grew to level 6. Bun Bun learned Ember. That was quick. It's not over yet. I've added another trusty ally to my team. Pokemon Trainer Hop stand out. Okay, Groupy. I don't have any life. Oh, maybe I do. Nice, Bun Bun had his HP, okay, some scratch, okay. Let's, what's Ember? Let's try Ember now. I wanna see what Ember does. Bun Bun used Ember. Oh wow, it's super effective. It burned him, so it keeps going down. I like that. Let's use tackle. Okay, so our attack fell, but his attack is falling because he's burned. So let's just use tackle again, and then it's game over. Yay! Your Pokemon gained XP points. Oh my god! Bum Bum grew to level 7. His HP went up to 24. Attack 16. Nice, nice. You defeated Pokemon Trainer Hop. You beat my two Pokemon with your one? You and that score bunny are too much. <laughs> I got 400 for winning. Yay, our first battle! Well, that was a shock. Guess I know... Guess I now know why Lee thought he should give you a Pokemon too. You and your Pokemon all fought hard. 
made me almost want to let our Charizard and join in all on the fun. Good effort out there, Score Bunny. Why don't I get you all sorted? And Lamalulu, you've got a real promise. In fact, I've got a favor to ask you. Be a real rival to Hop, would you? Push him and make the both of you stronger. I already want to get stronger and stronger. You've seen me battle now, Leek, so come on. You've got to let me take on the Pokemon gyms. You join the gym challenge? You think you're ready for the single greatest competition in the Galar region? Not putting the cart before the rap da rap Rappy Dash there, little brother. If that's really what you want to do, you two have a whole lot you need to learn about Pokemon. Especially your friend Lamalulu. Before you think about getting gym badges, best to think about getting a Pokedex. A trainer's Pokedex helps them learn uh, lots of things about all the Pokemon out there, including their strengths. But it's more than just a collection of data. You know it's a, rec it's a record of a trainer's love and passion of Pokemon training. Right, right, we get it, Pokedexes then. We're on it. Looks like it's off to the Pokemon Research Lab for you and me, Lamalulu. That's the kind of enthusiasm a trainer needs. I'll let the professor know to expect you. I'm going to be the next champion, so completing a simple Pokedex will be nothing. Just another page in the tale of my legend. You'd probably better go tell your mom that we're heading out, though. Okay, awesome. So, um, this was really cool. I feel like it's been long enough that I've been playing it. Um, we're just gonna go to her mom's house. Crash. Did you hear that just now? Oh, I think the Wooloo broke the fence. The gate's open and the Wooloo that was there is gone. It was tackling the fence pretty hard earlier. You don't think it actually broke through there? Do you? But it's off limits. Nobody's supposed to go in there. I remember the professor's granddaughter went in once and she came back in a real state. And that was nothing compared to the earful she got from the professor afterward. Mama Lulu, what do you say? Oh, another adventure? I say we've got to save it. Right. Even if we're not supposed to do this, this is the kind of scene where you simply have to do what's needed. <laughs> Hope you're ready for anything because we're going in, Mama Lulu. Okay, so instead of me seeing my mom, I have to now save the Wulu. Great. But I think I'm going to end this here. Everybody has seen this. Um, I, this is my first time, so I have not seen this. I am obsessed with the world. I am obsessed with the imaging of it, the way it was just like so professionally done and built. Um, honestly, I am so happy that I got this game, like I am obsessed. Right now, like I just want to keep going, but I don't want to make my recordings too long because I am using a capture card, so I don't know how far long this video is, and that's like another like setback for me, like I don't know, I, sh I should probably figure something out. I should probably put like a timer on my phone and record at the same time, and yeah, but my brain does not think like that, you guys. Um, Anyways, um, wow, this was really fun and very different, okay? I thought the professor was going to give us a Pokemon, but come to find out, it was Hop's brother, Leon, who is the undefeated champion. Like, wow, the introduction was just flawless. Um, and then just like the whole story in the beginning was just so cute, like I had no idea we were going to meet the undefeated champion. I thought the undefeated champion was going to be like our last person to see. Fortunately, that's not what happened. He was the first person we got to see. And I like that. I like how they changed everything. I like the new um, Pokemons that they added in. There are a few of the old ones still, but they did kind of change it up, I guess, from what I heard. But... I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed. And I'm just going to end this here, you guys. Um, enjoy the rest of your day. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, too. Please comment and like, subscribe, whatever you guys want. 
Let me know what you guys think. And yeah, bye my llamas.